been in the PR business for over 30 years, okay? She herself is an entrepreneur, but she started out at some of the uh, major PR agencies, including Ogilvie Mather, Ruder, Ruder Finn, Hill Holiday, I won't read the rest of them. In 1992, she founded HJMT Communications. I've already told them, Hillary, that you started in your apartment and then in your garage with the door that looked like it was a real garage door before moving to um, offices in the center of Long Island in New York City and Rochester. Hillary has won um, many awards. I won't read, um, read through them, but I do have her bio here. She's very committed to the community. She um, does a lot of volunteer work and serves on some, a, ver a variety of nonprofit boards. She um, is also a wife and a mother of two, and with that, What you need to do in social media is what is that you need to build a community. You want to get a community of like-minded people. Because the bottom line is, is that if, if you have a connection with people and you get to really know people, you're going to want to do business with them. You know, they're going to want to do business with you. I mean, how many people want to do business with people they don't like, right? You just don't want to do business with people like that. You want to do business with people you like. And the basic premise behind uh, this whole thing is getting a connection with people. Like, for example, how many people in the room, you know, like to go bicycle riding? Show of hands. Okay. So you've got like a little mini community here. Um, how many people have children? Okay. More of a community. You know, um, you know, just whatever activity, you know, like you have a dog and you walk in your dog and you start connecting with people who have dogs and, you know, the next thing you know, you're in a community with dog lovers, you know, or what have you. Uh, I love playing golf and I have, you know, like every time I get into a conversation with somebody about golf, we are, you know, we just start talking about different courses and we have that connection and that's what you're trying to do here, you're trying to build a connection. I'm going to go on to Skittles because this is really, really, really cool. Okay, so Skittles, yeah, everybody knows Skittles, right? You know, the candy. Okay. Uh, what they did was they took their website and decided to trash it. They took all their social media sites and they put it in one page. This is their home page, but sometimes they change it up and they'll make like their Facebook page their home page or their Twitter page their home page. If you go to, uh, you know, media, it'll take you to the YouTube videos that appear, you know, about uh, Skittles. If you go to Friends, it'll take you to their Facebook page and you can have conversation. And people are talking about like, oh, I like the red ones, I like the yellow ones, you know, like that was my favorite. You know? um, they have the chatter page, is their Twitter page. You know? That's their Wikipedia page, right? Yeah. This is their Wikipedia page, and it talks about all of their, um, you know, all the accomplishments. I mean, how great is this? You know, how great is this? I mean, and this was this really did not, they did not cost them a lot of money to do. And, it, and it's the coolest thing ever. It didn't cost them a lot to do. All they had to do was have somebody design this piece of it and link it all together. Well, you can link them all together yourself. You know, I mean, how ingenious is that? So I thought that was really cool. I wanted to show well, that. Why to do you. they do it? That's so weird. You know, because like, why do they need their website? The website's static. Here they have an opportunity to talk to their their consumers and have conversation.